We're also taking a deeper look at who Officer Nathan Heidelberg was and what he meant to those around him. Fox 24's Caleb Califano had the chance to talk to the chief of Seminole, a former officer with Midland PD who personally knew Officer Heidelberg. He joins us live in Midland with more. Well, Monica, unfortunately, this is the first MPD officer lost in the line of duty since the early 1960s. And yes, while it is a time to mourn, talking to the person who knew him, he says that Officer Heidelberg's life will go on and influence people for years and years. Nathan Heidelberg was a five-year veteran of the Midland Police Department and a field training officer. He sadly lost his life in a shooting early Tuesday morning. I always know him to be respectful, a uh, good moral character. I mean, he was just overall a good young man. We had the chance to speak with Chief Bernie Kraft of Seminole, a former veteran of MPD who knew Heidelberg personally. My uh, daughter and him, uh, like I said, we're just best friends. And uh, so that's how we kept in touch a lot. Um, so what happened today was really, it really hit home with me. Tuesday, departments from across West Texas showed their support for Officer Heidelberg, from Andrews to Brewster County. He's the kind of man, young man you want in law enforcement. I mean, he was good character, uh, believed in helping people, you know, did the best he could. For the Permian Basin, March 5th will go down as a sad, dark day. But looking at Officer Heidelberg's life, it brings a ray of light to those who knew him and those who want to be in law enforcement. You know, to young men and women that still want to step up and do this job, you know, you got to have good character. You know, you got to be a leader. You got to be a, a role model at times. And uh, he was it. Now, the flags here at MPD are lower to half staff, and they will stay that way for some time and off in honor of Officer Heidelberg's life. Live in Midland, Caleb Califano, Fox 24 News.